hello my beautiful and amazing people welcome back again to another update from sonia official so sonia official just posted this video some hours ago where she was telling us the whole truth like she spilled a lot in this video guys and you guys if you don't want to miss any part do not skip like watch the video to the end and hear what she said in this video so guys there are a lot of questions that viewers have been asking sonia official and even her husband to have been using some words against her which made her to come out to clear the air guys so some of the things she she said is that uh why she have not arrested the husband and the cousin you guys know when all this thing started people have been going to the comment section telling her to arrest the husband to arrest the cousin and so on but guys she explained her reasons why she have not done all of that guys and she also explained why she haven't given birth to another child you guys know the husband always come out to complain that sony official does not want to conceive again sony official is always busy with her work and she doesn't want to give him another child blah 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 that is why he went on to impregnate her cousin guys so she explained why she have not given birth to another child only her daughter okay so she also complained about what the husband is about to do guys that anytime if she ever leave the house if she ever leave that house that he is going to release her nude like that is most thing that people treat people with nowadays like if you dare to do anything they will just say they want to release your nude so that is exactly what sony official is passing through right now the husband threatening her that if she ever leaves the house or pack her things to do anything like he is going to release a nude guys so you guys watch the video and see what i'm telling you like she explained a lot of things guys okay but before you start watching please thumbs up for this video and subscribe guys so many people are asking questions sonia why have you not arrested your husband sonia what are you still doing in that house so many people have given me like they have give, uh, they, they came to my whatsapp to you know advise me that i should leave the house for him you understand but i just want to you know speak up you know sometimes it's very difficult for us to come out and talk because people will always think that what we we are saying that is prank and that is why sometimes it's very difficult for um we content creators to you know come out and say our mind or say what is going on in our lives because people will always think it's prank and all that but i've decided to speak up because if i don't speak now if i don't speak they will say why didn't she talk i've decided to talk my husband is threatening me with new my like my naked uh, video and picture he has on his phone and he said if i go out or if i decide to call police that he's going to post it online so he has been telling me that if i go out if i leave the house or if i if i leave the house or if i decide to call police because she has everything okay first of all we have a joint account where we both put money there and there's money there there's a lot of money in that account that's where we save our money okay my personal account i don't really have much there because i'm this kind of person once i get salary i would like to invest in one thing or the other so my things are more of investing like yeah, maybe if I, uh, uh, if I get salary, I'll buy one thing, one property then, you know. And he has seized all those stuff. Like, I don't even know where he kept everything right now. You understand? So, if if I leave this house, it's as if I'm, I'm, I'm living with nothing. Like, all my hard work, everything I've been through, like, it's as if I'm living with nothing. I'm, I'm not this kind of person that, look at me now, I don't even make hair, I don't wear clothes. It's not like I use my money to to make hair or to buy clothes. I don't I don't even wear clothes. So me, I believe in buying properties. Like I believe in buying properties. That's what I believe in. I don't believe in living an extravagant life. I don't believe in all those. I believe because I came from nothing. Like I came from nothing. My mother, my like my family, they are farmer. They are farmer. So we don't have anything before. Before God I blessed and we, I came to uh, 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 I came uh, before I became um, like before I became popular. Before I became popular, my mom, like my family, because my dad is late. 
It's only my mom that is still alive. And my mom is in the village. So nothing. I, I don't live I don't live all this life like to come and be buying this one, buying that one. No, no, no. I believe in buying properties. Because I know where I came from. I know where I came from. I don't want to ever go broke again. Because I know what my eyes have seen. You understand? Even sometimes with some people will say, so no, why don't you change clothes? It's not like I don't have money to buy whatever thing I want to buy. I own a boutique. Not like I don't have but no. That's not life. Like I know I know I know what I want. I know I'm this kind of person that plans my life. I know how to plan my life because I don't want ever to go broke again. So many people are saying, Sonia, why are you staying in that house? So this is the reason he has been threatening me that if I ever leave, I don't, I don't understand him. You said you want to marry my cousin. You want her to, you know, give you a son. That's why it's not like, okay, let me come to that. You know, after my first daughter, he said we should not give birth for now again. That we should walk, like we should walk and grow first before we have another child. Okay. So... I said no problem if it's what you want. So I don't know what he's he's now ranting that I don't want to give him another child. You know, it was this year, earlier this year, at the end, middle of this year that he said I will I should get pregnant, that he's ready now. I told him that you should please next year. You should please give me some more time next year. You understand? I begged him, okay, please, next year we'll start making babies. He was the one that told me that I should stop for now. Let's hustle first before we can you no know, start giving birth again that we should hold on with that one so i'm even surprised with this attitude even when he told me that okay let's start making babies again this is i said okay please because i have a lot of works here and this work is very stressful it's very very stressful i will go out i will go out nights around eight nine when i'm back i'll be tired sometimes you will go people will beat you and all that the whole of my body will you know stop so i told him that you should please let me finish up with the works I have by next year. I will take in so that you know, because as a pregnant woman, I mean, whenever I'm pregnant, I'm always very lazy, I cannot do anything for myself, I cannot do anything for myself. And the stress, I don't want that kind of stress when I'm pregnant. I said, Okay, don't worry, next year, when I'm ready to, you know, when I'm ready by next year, I think I will not accept more job because someone can pay for a job like from two months back. Plenty of people have booked you for you know this month already, so that's the way it works. So I said I have a lot this year. Let me just finish up this year. Next year I know okay, I will now I will not be working like that again. I can just stay in the house and create my content. Please give me this year. I was surprised with this whole thing, like with this whole attitude. This is not how my husband behaves. He's not this kind of man. He's not even my cousin sister who she's not like this. Like I'm very, very surprised. The whole thing that is happening now is like a movie to me. It's like a movie to me because I've never I've never caught him with any woman before. Like I've never seen him that he's cheating on me. I've never seen this kind of behavior before. Even my sister, I'm surprised with the attitude she's showing me now because hey God. This thing is very very hard to believe. Sometimes I, 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 I think what what is going on? Like what is really going on? What is really going on? I'm, I'm surprised. I'm surprised. Like okay, I will go to work because my husband told me that he doesn't want. I have a house help. Okay, that helps you know in the house chores and all that. So he told me because it's only Sundays that I'm I I don't work. Like I don't work on Sundays. I try not to work because I even have work on Sunday, but I try not to work so that I can cook for my husband. I do cook on Sundays and put in the fridge. Okay, so my husband, I used to sometimes, if I, if I close from work, before I would get home, it would be around 8 9. So he would, tell, he would tell me that he doesn't want my gear to be serving him, that he wants me to be serving him. So when I come back, I will rush you, you know, hold up, hold up, hold someone. Maybe when you finish, even if you finish earlier, around six, seven, before you get home, it will be around eight because of hold up. And it depends on this distance you're coming from. So I will still serve him food because he doesn't like my year to serve him. He said he wants me to be the one to serve him. So I don't know why he's complaining. Like Sunday I cook, I cook on Sundays, I put it in the fridge. 
sometimes i even go markets with my like i even go to the markets my friends will even be seeing me as soon as you they come markets they come market as soon as they put a card because most of them think i'm in lagos so i don't know i don't know i'm not this kind of person that even i'm not i'm not even doing all this celebrity stuff i know they do um, i don't do all this celebrity i i humble myself it's not like i don't even i don't know what is happening seriously like i don't know what is happening it's, it's only god that will see me through it's only god that will see me through because me i want to get my things i don't want i don't want to marry this man again seriously i don't want to and do anything with this man again i'm tired like i'm tired i don't want to do anything with him again i want to leave this marriage for good but i want him please people should beg him let him give me my things i can't be walking this side and i will go out with nothing i'll start a fresh again and go and open another page he's claiming that he owns my page yes he was the one that opened it he was the one that created the page but i'm the one walking i'm the one walking he's, a, he's my manager he's not managing me so you should give me my okay even if you want to say you're the owner of the page you're this one why not share the money at least i've been working i may, i i know how much even adverts that people pay for advert i advertise i know how much i know the millions only for advert i make we're not even talking about what facebook pays so you should give you should give me because our money now is in that joint account it's in just and only me cannot get access to that money only me cannot get us it has to be the both of us only me cannot get access to that money it has to be the both of us so right now right now right now i'm, I'm going through a lot i see some some people will come to my whatsapp to be asking me for money don't you even have conscience are you not seeing what is happening to me are you not even seeing what is happening to me is where i cannot even cry again i cannot even like i'm just so so done in my spirit right now like i'm so done i'm so done please i need your prayers i need your advice i need your encouragement all the things i can get now please before it was said i'm i'm speaking up now i'm speaking up now hi now wow my people this one is wickedness so after impregnating her cousin you see everything that she owns like everything that she has worked for all these years like this guy sees everything and now she wants to leave you're still threatening her with her private videos and all of that like it doesn't make sense guys Omo, this one really touched me. Like, I feel really sorry for Sonia. Like, Omo, guys, this one too much for this lady. Seriously, guys. I just pray that everything comes to an end. I just pray that all these things, like, the, the causes that we realize herself and she will apologize to Sonia. That's just what I'm thinking about, guys. Because I don't see why these people are still remorseful. Why they are still proving stubborn. Even when they had meetings, like everything has just been going on the late day they cause this sister came with her friends to to beat up a senior official and to show her out then when they had meeting everything was still scattered and all of that like these people are not even ready to to make peace but senior official wants to leave still this man does not want to release her like what is really happening guys so you guys and uh, what do you think she should do next yeah because at this moment she is trapped with that uh, nude videos of a thing and all of that guys so you guys leave your opinion in the comment section and don't forget to thumbs up for this video subscribe turn on your post notifications so that you get notified whenever i come back with a new update i will see you guys in my next video bye for now